Hello, Nomad Sculpt and Tube Profile. This is an additional video to the first uh, one. It's about the symmetry. Okay, so here let's let's start with the plane and uh, the tube. Let's create a path and add a profile, open profile. Come on. So this is correct division. So now we have our starting point, and um, I adjust here the intersection here with the other um, object, and I change the nodes to black. So and I use a closed option. At the top you see here the mirror option. So if you want to create um yeah, let's create a, a spaceship or something. So make sure that a few points overlap here a little bit. So something like this. So this is um, the contour of the spaceship. So and the next thing is here, we can use here the ready option. And now you have the the crazy thing is you have to find now the the correct nodes. So something here like this. It's confusing. Where is my? Yeah, I think here, this one, like this. This a little bit more, and this one. So this is a spaceship hull. Oh, let's adjust this one a little bit more. So, okay. And this mirror node is only um, to help uh, a little bit. So, yeah, you can deactivate it because it, it doesn't work with this. So, you can play with your um, here with um, divisions a little bit, but it's the best um, to use here the, the white division here low and maybe. Um, the X division a little bit more and if you like here in your profile um, a chamfer or something then do it now so here like this and so now the object has a nice chamfered edge but the chamfer is um, yeah, linked to the radius you use. So now it's okay. So you can you can validate your object, and here the overlapping for the for the mirror. So here you see the overlapping. If you like it more like this, then use the overlapping like this. Okay. So let's deactivate the mirror and validate this object. So now you can use the close holes option. And now use the, the symmetry here and mirror from right to the left. So now you have your, your nice shape here. 
and um, if you like you can use the move tool a little bit and activate the symmetry so you can adjust here a little bit um, the shape And the nice thing is, here is your spaceship, and if you like it more organic, so you can use the multi-resolution here, and, and you can use um, the linear subdivision, subdivided, and now you can adjust a few more move points here um, to create a yeah, your shape you want, you want, and and if you like it a little bit more organic, then deactivate the linear subdivision and subdivide it um, like this. So I go a step back, and here you got it as an organic shape, and. So you can play with the with the subdivisions. So you can create really nice shapes. And again, here another small example. So when you want here your um, your windows, I turn the wireframe on and create a profile closed option so and change the divisions division you can use a little bit more so and now create your your window frame to increase uh, the Y division yeah and for the profile here make sure this one here when it's additive and you s select your profile, you see here, this is the intersection with the other object here. So here it's possible to create um, a chamfer or something like this. And so now when you, you validate your object here, yeah, and as I said here, copy copy this uh, tube path so and validate uh, this one and then here in the MISC menu you can close the holes and here for this I use a uh, higher detail so close holes like this and this is the shape you get and the next thing here is um, I mask this this object here. I select the other one. And then use the boolean operation. So now you have your window.
cut out and here in the mask you can now split your object so now it's possible to to make this mesh here invisible so you can look inside your um, other mesh of course you can uh, mirror this whole thing to the other side and your first mesh so this one here let's try it if it works you can close the holes so and if it's in inverted you can use the uh, inverse culling option so now you can uh, give it a refraction material so turn the wireframe off yeah this is uh, you can do much more with, with it um, so um, so now you have your windows in this object and yeah play with it it's a really useful thing I think have fun with sculpting, ciao.